here in San Carlos, you can't just jump on the train, jump on a subway, jump on a light rail, and go to the multiplex. And I think sometimes Native adults have said, oh, our Native kids, they're losing their culture. They haven't really lost anything. They just want access to goods and services like everyone else. Just open the shop, come check it out, Apache Agency. It means a lot, you know, it's a hub for the skaters here. The younger generations is the key. You gotta psych them up, get them motivated, get them hyped. That's the key to the future. The Apache team, Doug, Trey, Elijah, P, Ruben, Erwin, Tasha, Razel, Keith, the ones that are not here, the new members, they're heavy cats. Uh, they didn't get good by accident, they got good on purpose. They're the ones out in the street getting bloody, getting tore up, but they're the ones also stoking out kids and teaching kids, you know, it's cool and it's fun to skate and it's fun to be yourself. My great-grandmother, uh, who is still alive, she had to endure such a tremendous amount of pain for me to even live. And then that pain followed to my mother. It could have followed me, but it didn't. Wherever you, you're from, it's, it's not gonna dictate where you're going. I think that's why it's really moving for me to connect my culture with you know, my skateboard culture because I realized that there's a rich, pungent aura that I'm supposed to carry to transfer to touch a little girl's heart that needs it and that needs to get told, hey, you're special. And you're gonna change the world. I am my ancestors. I'm the walking embodiment of everything that they were or they are. If I don't walk in, in the path that's been put before me, then I'm not fulfilling the path that they wanted me to fulfill in the first place. When I see little artist's hands, I see the hands of an artist. I'm looking at my own immortality. And the minute he touches my hand and my hand touches his, he's touching eternity. That's why grandparents have such a great love for their grandkids. He's me 53 years ago. I'm him 53 years from now. So in a tumultuous political time, it's good to unplug. Take a step back and look around you and look at the family that you have, look at the friends that you have. Go visit your neighbor, go take some food to your mom, go chop wood for your dad, go help someone and don't put it on social media. Don't tell everybody what you did because when you do those things, you're, you're helping your world. The greatest leaders have always been the most generous leaders. They've given. And some leaders, some of the greatest leaders, give their life. Why did I decide to spend my last 30 years working for young people in my community? I want young people to live. I want young people to see their own potential. And I want my community to go into the next century strong and bold and courageous. My art took me to the De Young Museum in San Francisco to do work with friends in the South Bronx, to the hallowed halls of Columbia University. But I stay here in San Carlos. We birthed an important skateboard brand here on the res.